Welcome back. We're now going to create an equipment and install it at a functional location. The transaction code is IE01. We can get to the same transaction code from SAP menu, logistics, plant maintenance, management of technical objects, and finally to equipment. So let us go ahead and create a new equipment. We need to enter our date here, the valid on date. This is today's date. Then we need the equipment category. We can select from a list that is available here. And we got this list from when we customized the equipment. So in our case, we're going to select machines. So that is selected. Once you've done that, we go to enter. Then we need to enter the description of our equipment. It's going to be water pump. The status is available at this point. This is a valid on date. And this is a general tab here. There's some fields that we need to populate, such as the object type, the weight if we need to. We need to enter the manufacturer data. Could be something like Danfoss. And any other information that will be available or will be we have to identify our equipment. Once we've done that, we need to go to the second tab, which is location. The plant is BRIQ. Then we need to identify the location, the room number if we have it, plant section, work center, the ABC indicator. It could be something like department shutdown, indicator one. The sort field if we have it. And then we can move on to organization. Again, organization data, we need the company code. That is Bridges IQ. The business area, that is information. That is some of the information that we, uh, we, we get when we're doing our configuration. Then the asset number, cost, cost center, and the rest of the information like planner group here. We have three planners here. We have process planners, catalog profile. Again, we can check what catalog profiles we have. And I had created one which is test OCN. So that is our catalog profile. And we, we can do the same to the rest of the fields. Finally, we need to go to structure. And right here we need to enter or to install our equipment at a functional location. Right now the status is available. We want to have status as installed. So to do that, we go to this icon here and we need to enter the functional location where we want to install our, equip our equipment. So that is BRIQ-341-CA-10. We select it. And now our status has changed from available to installed. That means that our equipment has been installed at this functional location. So that is the functional location and that is the description. So that is how we create an equipment and install it at a functional location. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.